today I wanted to share a tip that I use all the time because the tech world is always changing. Squarespace is always changing. So I just got back from vacation and I wanted to update the SEO description of my website. So I popped into marketing and it used to be right here and it's not here now. So how do I find it? Well, if I'm looking for something and I don't know what it is, but I know what it's called, if you hit the forward slash key on your website, so it's the keyboard key that looks like that, it's on the US, it's on the question mark key on the lower right of your keyboard near the shift uh, key. So you'll hit forward slash and then you can start typing in what you're looking for. So if I start typing in SEO, it will take me to SEO appearance, which is exactly what I was looking for. Um, if someone asks you to set permissions on your website to add them as an, an administrator, you would hit the uh, forward slash key and start typing in permissions and then it will take you here. So that is a tip that I've used because things are in flux all the time. And as long as you know what something's called, you can find it using that step. Another tip that I wanted to share is that there is a similar search feature when you're editing a page and you're looking for blocks. So for example, if I want to edit this section and I roll over and I want to add a block. So this is a classic editor section. So I add a block by cl clicking this uh, blue plus icon and I can just start typing what I want to add. So if I want to add a code block, I can do that here. Um, if I want to add a uh, reservation block, uh, then I start typing reservations. Uh, this takes me to talk, or I can do open table, or I can do events. So if you know what you're looking for, there is a really quick way to find it here. So another thing you could do if you want to add like an Instagram block instead of um, searching for that, you just pop one in here. I'm gonna go ahead and exit this and I'm not gonna save it. And you can do the same thing for fluid engine sections. So for example, this is a fluid engine section. You don't see those blue plus icons, um, but you do have this add block button in the upper left. That's how you know this is a fluid engine section, not classic editor. But again, the search works the same. So if I wanted to add an Instagram block here, I'd start typing and it will give me the Instagram block here. You can see things look a little different because it's fluid engine, but the search process works the same. So again, if you know what you're looking for, you know what it's called and you just can't find it, this search feature will save you a ton of time. Hope this tip was helpful and I wish you the best of luck with your website.